Mr. Alfredo Pasto is now an economics professor at IESE Business School in Barcelona. He joins us on the phone now, Mr. Pasto. Thanks very much for your time. So what is the immediate priority for Mariano Rajoy's government? It seems to me that, uh, first of all, he has to talk to uh, two heads of government in uh, the rest of the EU. But second of all, I think he has to reach an agreement with the Socialist Party and with other parties to be able to carry the, re the reforms that have to be carried out. They are so uh, deep that uh, they cannot be undertaken by just one party. How difficult is it going to be to forge the political consensus that you describe? Well, I hope it will not be very difficult because it seems to me that everyone sees the, the need for a, a consensus government on these, main, on these main reforms. Do you think that you are saying that it's important to reach an agreement uh, with the various parties? How much pushback do you think Mr. Rajoy will get from his own party when it comes to making deep and, of course, potentially unpopular structural reforms? Well, that will be certainly uh, a difficult task for Mr. Uh, Rajoy. But uh, he has to reach that sort of agreement. And it seems to me that uh, Mr. Rajoy has shown to be a man of agreements and a prudent man. So I guess mm. he'll, be, he'll carry through this task. Mr. Pasta, how concerned are you about how further austerity measures would impact demand in the country and tax revenue? Well, it seems to me that uh, no, no further uh, austerity measures are required. Our problem is now more a problem of revenues than a problem of uh, spending as far as public finances are concerned. The problem is that the current austerity measures will have to be in place for, uh, for some time to come. You say that no further austerity measures are needed, but uh, as you say, you allude to the fact that spending is a problem, isn't it? And I'm just yes. wondering about the regions on the provincial level in Spain. That has been a big concern. It's perceived to be a big risk by the markets as well. Now, the PP already controls 11 of the 17 regional governments. So I'm just wondering, will that make it easier then to perhaps reorder finances in the regions to bring spending under control? Well, it will, it will be difficult, but I, th I think it will, be, it, be, it will be doable. It seems to me that the, the situation is by now pretty well known. All right. So I want to ask you about uh, Mr. Arajoy's relations with his European partners. He's pledged to stand up to the French and Germans. But, of course, you know, obviously this is the, the, he's going to have to work with them to an extent as well, is he not? Yes, and I think he's fully aware of that. And uh, uh, Mr. Rajoy is not a confrontational person, so I think that he will be, he will be, uh, uh, he will not find it very difficult to work with them. In fact, uh, President Zapatero uh, uh, submitted very uh, with uh, docility to uh, the to the instructions of the Germans and the, and the, and the right. French. Mr. Pasto, just another very quick final question to you. Yes. We've, we've seen Spain's borrowing costs rising sharply in the markets over the past few weeks. We're edging towards the 7% level, which saw other countries uh, ask for international help. What is the possibility of Spain needing a bailout? I think the possibility of a bailout for Spain as for Italy is zero. Uh, what is needed is to stabilize the market and to offer some guarantees that the, uh, the, the, the needs for the next year or so, where Spain has a peak in, in financing, will be, will be covered. And that is something that can be done. And once the markets are, uh, are sure that this will happen, uh, they will see that Spanish debt is uh, still uh, good business because uh, it is a solvent country and it deals uh, quite a bit more than German bonds. All right. Well, thanks very much, Lee Alfredo Pasto, economics You're professor welcome. at IESE Business School and former Spanish deputy finance minister. Good to get your thoughts, of course, on the results.